Hey guys, I am so happy you decided to click in this video and now that you're already here, please subscribe as well. Welcome to another episode of DIY which is a pilot hat for my son's career day. Let's begin by getting a chipboard and draw the elements to use. I don't know if you can see the drawing but here are the three parts of a pilot hat. Band, crown, and the visor. First is the band which will be determined by measuring the circumference of the head, then 5 cm width. Second, we make a set of circle for the crown. The inner circle will be the diameter of the head plus 5 cm. The outer circle will be the diameter of the inner circle plus 12 cm. Since I already have the circumference of the head from the band that we made, let's apply math to get the diameter. Third one is the visor which is 16 cm length, 6 cm width, and 3 cm of the thickest part on the middle. Then cut the parts. For the circle, cut several notches from the outer circle up to the inner circle with 2 inches apart. Then fold the notches inward. Connect the ends of the band with a tape. The chipboard is thick, difficult to attach together with the band. I cut the notches alternately. I switched to a masking tape because it holds better than the transparent one. To make the pilot hat looks like it is slanting, tape back part as low as it can be. I recommend you use a tape dispenser to make this task smooth and easy. I could use a hat before this but I just didn't because the connected parts will be reinforced when covered with the fabric. The first part to cover is the top or the crown. I am using E7000 industrial glue which also works for fabric. Cut the excess fabric but not close to the edges as we need a little allowance for the next step. Get another fabric and fold the edges. Fold the excess fabric from the top of the crown, then attach the fabric on the sides, starting from the back of the hat. I had to be careful in attaching this because the fabric is white which easily gets dirty and the glue might leave some stains. Then cut the excess fabric up to the base of the crown where the band is connected. Also, glue the fabric to that area. It's a tricky part because I don't want it to have folds, but it's inevitable, so be it. Get a black fabric and again fold the edges. Glue it on the band area of the hat starting at the back part. Fold 
Fold the excess fabric inwards, then glue. Cover the visor with black fabric again, then glue it onto the band of the pilot hat. Cut a slit in the middle because the edge is curved. Also, make sure the visor should be in a slant-like position. Put two strips of yellow ribbon around the band of the pilot hat starting from the back. Finally, here's our DIY pilot hat! That's all for today. I hope you enjoyed the process. Please subscribe and see you in the next videos. Thanks for watching.